The face of hunger in America is changing. That's right. Most think of the homeless or inner city families, but it is creeping into the suburbs. NBC4's Ellie Merritt is joining us now with another view of hunger. Ellie? Well, food banks in the suburbs are seeing 40, 50, 60 percent increases in need. This isn't generational poverty. It's situational poverty, meaning the need for food for many families came out of the blue and often very fast. At warm, the Westerville Area Resource Ministry, the need at the food pantry is up, way up. As the economy continues to stall, uh, as the jobless rate stays high, you see people that maybe were living on the edge before getting pushed over the edge. There's been a lot of that in this economy. Jobs gone, homes lost, and Scott Marrier sees families struggling to pay the bills and buy groceries. It means that a family is not sure of where their next meal is coming from. When they go to the cupboard tonight or go to the refrigerator after school, it's bare, and they're not sure whether it'll be dinner or whether it'll be breakfast. So they come here hoping to skimp by another month. They're not alone. At the Mid-Ohio Food Bank, they are sending out more food to the burbs. And now we're seeing significant increases. You're talking 40, 50 percent, 60 percent increases over the past couple of years. Children and seniors make up almost 50 percent of the folks who get food. They are the most vulnerable. And the highest increase in need is in the suburbs. We have families that might have been a two-income household. You lose one of those incomes, you still have a mortgage or a rent payment based on a two-income household. You still have utility payments. You still have car payments, medical bills all those other things, and food kind of get, gets pushed down that list. 57% of clients say they are choosing between paying utilities and food. Bottom line, the American family, once stable, is now on rocky ground. The faces of poverty in um, the suburbs looks a lot like your face and a lot like my face. There are people who are suffering from um, a situational poverty where their life got turned upside down. And NBC4 is here for you with Four's Army working with the Mid-Ohio Food Bank to make sure everybody has enough to eat for Thanksgiving. We hope you will join us this Saturday, November 12th, from 8 a.m. until 2 p.m. We will be accepting non-perishable food items and monetary donations at our studios on Olentangy River Road. Thanks so much, Ellie. New information tonight on a crash that took two women's lives early 